Todd from San Antonio asks, if you were starting a new limousine company, what would be the first thing you'd do? Todd, I've never been asked that question before, but I think it's actually probably the best question that anybody has ever asked me. Um, and I've really never given it a whole lot of thought and specifically to the limousine industry, but with any business, you've got to start with a plan. And I don't mean a very traditional you know, business plan to where you're creating an executive summary and kind of going through what I think is a lot of BS. I think what you have to have is a strategy in the limousine industry. And where I see a lot of companies failing is they don't know what's the primary buyer, that buyer persona that you're gonna go after, number one to build your company. That's the first thing that you have to determine before you buy a vehicle, before you get into software, before you build your website, you have to know after you have to know that number one buyer. Then you have to figure out the secondary buyer and then the tertiary buyer. So you've got one, two, three buyers that you're gonna go after. And that could be on the corporate side of the business. You might be going after travel managers for large companies. You might be going after admins for medium-sized companies. And then for that lower end, you might be going after me because I'm business travel bill, that individual traveler. So that's the first thing that you have to determine. Then you need to know what their pain points are. You need to know how you're gonna provide solutions to their pain points. Then the real first step is you're gonna build out your website, addressing those pain points by providing solutions for those individual buyers. Once you have that on your website, here is really the first true tactical thing that you have to do and that's build your email list. That means you have to have a conversion opportunity or multiple conversion opportunities with what we call lead magnets behind it and build your email list. That's where I see one of the biggest problems in our industry. And the reason that you wanna build your email list is because it is free or virtually free to be able to market to those people that you have on your email list. So that's where I would start, Todd, and that's where I hope you will start if you're just starting a limousine company or if you're already in it and haven't done those things, then please go back. It doesn't matter how long you've been in the industry, what the size of your company is, what city you're in, knowing that strategy about your buyers, building that content into your website, into your marketing, into your sales process, your overall customer acquisition strategy, and then building your email list. I hope that helps, Todd. Have a wonderful day, and I look forward to seeing all of you on the next episode of the Ask Limo You Show.